Reproduction in plants Structure of a typical flower Typical flower consists of four walls Calyx, Corolla, Andresia, Gynesium Number one is calyx It is the outer wall Its leaves are called sepals, green in color and its function is to protect the inner part of the flower Number two is corolla, the wall following the calyx. Its leaves are called petals, which is colorful and scented to attract insects, which helps in the process of reproduction. The corolla function is to protect the, the reproductive organs. Number three is andresium, the wall following the corolla. Its leaves are called stamens. Andresium. The stamen consists of a fine filament ending by a sac known as the answer, which is divided into two, two parts, each of which has two chambers containing pollen grains. Gynesium, the force and innermost wall of the flower. Its leaves are called carpels which resembles a flask in shape and is formed of bulge known as ovary connected to a tube called the psi which has an open called stigma the ovary contains the ova